James Nesbitt returned to screens for the second series of thrilling procedural Bloodlands on Sunday. However, BBC viewers shared their disappointment on social media as many were left confused by the storyline. After the first season of Bloodlands came to an end in March 2021, many fans were eagerly awaiting the show's comeback. With James starring as DCI Tom Brannock, he returned with DS Neve McGovern, played by Charlene McKenna, and the rest of the team to crack down on crime in Northern Ireland. While the gritty crime drama received rave reviews after season one, the premiere seemed to be a miss with viewers who lost track of the storyline. Many took to Twitter to share their confusion and disappointment following the highly anticipated episode. An underwhelmed at C75 asked other viewers, anyone else disappointed with hashtag Bloodlands? A confused at Nimit added, when you come back for season 2 and have not one single clue is going on. At Vixter51 criticized, not having a series 1 recap is really stupid. I'm already lost. A fourth viewer at Nyala Lachlan tweeted, first time in long time, myself and the missus turned to each other and said Jesus this is a C. Terrible acting and script. Sick, despite the negative feedback, Bloodlands was also praised by others who enjoyed the first episode and defended the drama. At Olive Yog 37717638 stated, fast-paced already. James Nesbitt is amazing. A pleased at Gowan Media added, great first episode of the new series of Bloodlands tonight on, BBC One. Thankfully for fans, season two will contain more episodes than its predecessor with six in total rather than four. Dot Emmerdale fans work out Sandra Flaherty's true identity in Twist, Insight, the premiere picked up from the jaw-dropping twist from the first series which saw Tom exposed as Goliath. It was revealed he had been blackmailed by David Corey, Ian McElhinney, into murdering two victims. Tom followed the instruction because David had kidnapped his wife Emma Brannock, however when she was returned, she no longer wanted to be with the officer. As a result, a frustrated Tom shot and killed David and proceeded to tell Emma to disappear for good. Things got even more complicated for the cop when someone from his past threatened to expose his secret identity. Series 2 opened up with flashbacks to 1998 with Tom in a balaclava as he watched a gun running operation from a distance. However, in the present day, he and Neve were called to investigate the murder of accountant Colin Foyle, who he recognized straight away as someone from his past. Bloodlands continues weekly on BBC iPlayer.